Yep. Yep. Bravo Gaming Club, worst pickup. I don't know the episode anymore. It doesn't even matter. We're back in the basement finally. My name is Dan. This is a weekly pickup show of all sorts of media varieties. This week, we got our old friend, Baseline Ben, who's going to keep it as baseline as they come. Very right? much. No, no fluctuations. No You're going to notice that. It doesn't matter. We got a stack of stuff. Ben has brought over a birthday present for me, which is very kind of him. We were just talking about life upstairs. I guess yep. work for him is a struggle, just like work for me is a struggle. Yes. Does, Very much. Does work ever get yes. you down? Like, sad inside? Uh, it's, it's not that far yet. Oh, fuck. All right. But it, it's getting there. Okay, okay. It's getting there. <laughs> well, we're going to talk, we're going to talk some video games. We're going to talk some box sets, we're going to talk about presents, we're going to talk about some other things as well, but we're going to get right down to it. We got a stack, we got a, I got a banana box over here. You know where I got this banana box? Molly's? No, no, I got it from the grocery store, and guess who gave it to me? Triple A. Oh, yeah. The All-American Athlete is now working at the grocery store, guys. So if you're looking for AAA, I know where you can find them. But right off the bat, thrifting this week, we found Mythbusters, the book. Ben, are you a fan of Mythbusters? I, I do like Mythbusters. It's a, it's a fun watch, right? Yeah. You got some science in here. I You know, I love these novelty books that tie in with, with shows I really enjoy. Yeah. It's, it's good for the bathroom. You throw it in there, you take a shit with it a few times. <laughs> <laughs> then you put it on the shelf and it hangs out. So that's good. Uh, we also got the complete volume two Guns N' Roses. You know what this is? Uh, guitar temperature? It sure is, Ben. You ever fucking played guitar tab? No. No? No, not at all. Okay. It's not very hard. Well, to master it's hard, but to, to read it's not hard. Uh, found this at the thrift store. This is the Apple Dumpling Gang 1 and 2. And the best part of this, that was $10 at Walmart. That looks like an old sticker, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't use red for anything. Anymore. And when was the last time... <laughs> when was the last time Walmart charged $10 for a DVD? Wait, is that... Is that December 09? Yeah. All right, there well, this is. is this is uh this is some old shit right here. Yeah. So I did good on that. You you like Dawn Knots? Yeah, I've actually I've seen the first movie uh, a couple times. Oh, you have? Yeah, it's a good watch. But Rides Again, you've never seen? I don't think I saw that one. Yeah, I don't think I've seen that one either. Uh oh, this is so cool. So, uh, Kid and Play. Are you familiar with Kid and Play? No. Guys, you know Kid and Play. Ain't gonna hurt nobody. House party, the movies? No. No. Nah. Okay. Well, <laughs> we don't get the reference there, but that's the cassette. And why did I get that? Because God damn it, these pops, <laughs> kid and play pops right here. Jesus. They did like a famous. It's like their famous like dance move where they do like the foot thing. You've <laughs> you've seen it before, Ben. You know. You must know. I mean, maybe. Uh, oh, I had to order this. I was pumped. I thought I wasn't going to get a chance to get this, and then it popped up on Amazon, and I had to get it. This is the Joy-Con for the Skyward Sword. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. I didn't have the extra... I don't have an extra set of Joy-Cons, so I'm like, well, I do uh, now. You definitely need them, too. You, you do need them, and this is probably the coolest one to have so far. Yeah. I would assume. So you didn't get... You didn't buy these. No. I thought you would have been all over these too. No, actually, I recently replaced mine, so I mean, I, I probably sh should have got a set. I mean, they're still available, I think, on Amazon. Yeah. So if anyone's going to get backups, I would suggest getting some of these because they're pretty awesome. Uh, so I've been working all summer with my, my uh, co-worker, Greg. He's a college student. And we bonded over video games. Like, a lot of the same games. He, and we were talking about the Wii. I guess he was like seven years old when the Wii came out. I was like, oh right. shit, okay. 
But he's like, yeah, you used to always play 007. I'm like, oh yeah, all right. It's like the remake, GoldenEye. It was originally on the 64, but they, they ported it over to the Wii. Right. And the cool thing about that was there was a controller that came in a bundle. So you had a golden gun in in uh, in the game. Yeah. So they made the golden controller for it. And I'm like, God, I wish I had the golden controller. He's like, I don't, I might have had that. So last week he comes in, he goes, puts it on the table. He's like, happy birthday. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. That's oh, awesome, that is, right? That is cool. So the fact that he thought of me, went through his wee shit that was probably God knows where. And he's, uh, he's like, I don't even think we use this. So that was very nice of Greg to do that. There we go. Uh, I just ordered this off of eBay. I had to do it. This is <laughs> The Incredible Hulk, the complete series, starring Lou Ferrigno. Yeah. Did you ever watch this? It was from uh, the late I, 70s. I don't know if I ever caught it. I'm aware, I was aware of it. You've seen highlights, obviously. Yeah. Of super cheesy, <laughs> over the top. Um, 50 bucks brand new. This normally goes for upwards of 90, so... We did well on eBay on this one. Yeah, it's a good deal. Sexy box, too, huh? Right. Goddamn. Put some work into that. Yep. Uh, what else we get here? Um, oh, Locked Out of the Thrift. It's always cool when you find complete series at the thrift because they're five bucks. Yeah. So you don't want to find season one because five bucks for season one is not a very good deal. Technically. But if you find a complete series... You got the whole deal. This is Vegas. I don't even know what Vegas is. But I got the whole series now. There come, we go. Come on. That's something. Yeah. That's, ben, that's I've awesome. resorted to collecting TV box sets now because you can't really collect video games anymore. Right. Because it's too expensive. Right. But you can still find... Because no one wants fucking those things. They're like, get them out of my house. I don't want them. I'll yeah. take them. Um, oh, this was cool. Found the, the complete series. Well, it's, it's missing one season that was never released in the States, but Sean the Sheep. It's all four seasons right here. <laughs> Are you familiar with this? Uh, not really with Sean the Sheep, but I mean, it looks like it's very Wallace and Gromity. It's, which... a, it's the same people. Okay. It is the same people. I mean, you can tell right away, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, there it is. Oh, from yeah, the creators. You guys watch the show out there? I'm, I'm sure someone, you know, you guys are always good about this stuff. I, I'm excited about this. I'm actually going to watch this. I'm going to watch this. Uh, what else? Picked up some, some Switch games this week. It's been a while since I actually went out and bought some Switch games. GameStop? I, I feel bad. I barely go anymore. It's like once a month. I make up for it. Oh, do you? <laughs> yeah. Well, I went in, I, I talked to the manager, and he's like, I looked for something. He couldn't find it. He's like, oh, I feel so bad, Dan. You and Ben, I take care of you guys. He does. He, he, he does. Really he's, does. He's, he's a good guy. Uh, but what he did find for me was the, the great Ace Attorney Chronicles that just came out last week, I do believe. Yeah, uh, last week or the week before, maybe. So this was the, the Japan only release that they uh, that they redid for the states here. Okay. So pretty cool. I used my five dollar off, so it was thirty five dollars. It's decent. Decent, decent. You ever play any of those Ace Attorney games? I didn't. I was actually going to pick up this one to see if it was a good jumping on point, but I, I don't think it is. Uh, I mean, I, I've I've heard that it's not a bad place to start. Yeah. As far as, because obviously, unless you have a DS, you can't really, Yeah. you're not able to play them. Uh, these were GameStop grabs, too. Um, we got Fallen Legion. Uh, yeah, I don't, this is, what is it, NIS America. So, it looks like a 2D RPG. Yeah. Where you're kind of like shuffling your guys to battle the enemies. And you got cooldown in between, so you gotta like pick the way you attack. Yeah. Did you play this at all? I didn't. I see it on the eShop every once in a while. Uh, I take a look at it on the eShop every once in a while. And for 20 bucks, brand new. Not a bad yeah, price. Because we know the NIS stuff, it's weird at GameStop. Have you noticed this? That 
once they do their initial run, it like becomes impossible to find it. Yeah, pretty. I mean, unless it's a mainline like a Disgaea title. Yeah. yeah, even those are tough. Like it seems like they they always go on clearance, but only in store. Yeah. So their website's always sold out. So we did good on that. And all, this is why I wanted this forever too. Deadly Premonition Two. And I think I paid seventeen dollars for this. That the sticker's wrong. Did you play this one? No, I played the first one. Oh, and you you had your fill after that. Yeah, I mean, I I, I don't know why I I could not. Get did you buy it, it on the Switch? The no, first one? I, no, the first one I believe I did on the three sixty. All right, yeah. So interesting. Yeah, I know this isn't great, but it's one of those those titles you want in your your collection just because it's. Yeah. How, what I were mean, the chances they were gonna make a number two? Yeah. I mean, Rising Stars made some interesting, like, usually what they do is really cheap, um, but... <laughs> really shitty and cheap. It, it depends. Some of them are decent, some of them are just kind of... Uh... <laughs> yeah, what, what's the what's the biggest game by them that you, you think of? You're like, oh, that was alright. Uh, I didn't mind Assault Suit Lanos. Oh, alright. That was decent. That was them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't a bad game. Uh... All right, Benjamin. So we got the present that you brought over. <laughs> we're doing it live right here. This is very kind of you. So All we're right. just we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. What? Oh, Benjamin. Benjamin. Ho! Oh! Now this. Oh wow. All right. This is Evil Dead 2, the board game. This is fucking incredible, Ben. Right. You know this is one of my favorite movies of all time, right? Yep. I got my figure over there, I got my VHS copy, and now I got the fucking board game. Holy shit, Ryan Parker, you ain't got this shit. <laughs> I'll tell you what, this is awesome, Ben. Well, there you go. Oh, fuck. Happy birthday. Thank you so much. Oh, fuck, do you, do you paint the fucking figures? I don't even know. I mean, you could leave them that way, or you can paint them. This is incredible. Easily the coolest fucking board game I got now. And I got some cool board games. Yeah, I, I kind of racked my brain on that one. I could not remember what you had. Yeah, there's no way, because most of my collection has is, is been found pretty much at the thrift, and you would the chances of you ever finding this at a thrift store? Slim to none. Slim to none. Wow, this is incredible. This is going right here, Ben. That's... A fucking display piece if I ever seen one. Wow. All right. We sh probably should have fucking closed it with that, but we didn't, because <laughs> now it's gonna go downhill from there, guys. <laughs> Especially when I show you the best of Mr. Ed Volume One and Two. <laughs> <laughs> you watch Mr. Ed at all? No, I'm aware of it. It's a fucking talking horse, uh, guys. God bless TV Land. Look at that. <laughs> The sad part is I have the complete box set, but I felt the need that I needed the best of as well. Wait, oh. Is it possible the box set does not include the best of? No, no, no. It, it has everything. So I just went downgraded with this as well. God, look, it's a, got a cutout. You can't see, but it's a cutout. It's a talking horse. In America, at one point, at one point in America, a talking horse was something of entertainment. That was the highlight. Once a week. <laughs> and it still entertains me. Uh, we found another one of these baseball uh, box sets. This is the Red Sox 2007 World Series. I remember this World Series. I was in Santa Fe, New Mexico, working on a, a, a keepsake of luck record, River City Rebels. Um, but I remember we had this on the TV. So it's kind of like... Um, you a get a, soft spot. You got a connection to it. There is a connection there. That was a, that was a big year for the Red Sox. Uh, oh, this was cool. Hanna Barbera stuff. I couldn't believe I found this at the thrift. Uh, Dastardly and Muttley. Did you ever see this? I saw them in the Wacky Races. But yeah, I never so saw the actual spin-off. Like, yeah, that's that's pretty cool. That is neat. So, uh, and to keep up with the Hanna Barbera theme, we also found Hong Kong Fooey. <laughs> 
You remember Hong Kong Fu? I remember Hong Kong Fu. That's the complete series, and also, also, Yogi Bear. There we go. So, it, it's it's pretty cool because I just got Wacky Racers. Yeah. On the, the complete series, because I'm like, if there's one Hanna Barbera show that I really want, that's it. Yeah. It's fun, right? It's, yeah, it sticks out. Uh so whoever donated all their, I'm sure I hope it, it wasn't somebody dying that donated their, you know, the family donated all their stuff. Because a lot of this TV shit, I'm like, man, I think someone might have died. Because if you're down with Perry Mason, you're probably pretty old. It's solving murder mysteries, but it's it's pretty cool. And this is the, the movie collection. Like, how do you have this many movies? I don't... Uh, based on a TV show. I don't... I Ben, I don't know either. And it's the same with this. This is Colum Columbo's uh, mystery movie collection. <laughs> I love Columbo. You ever, you ever see Columbo? I, I haven't seen Columbo. Shh. I watched all the episodes. Back when I was really poor, we'd go to the library and borrow um, seasons. Yeah. Check them out. And that was entertainment. It was slim pickings, all right, Ben? Yeah. Did the best we could. Uh, I picked this whole series up. You ever seen the middle? Off and on. All right, well, yeah. this is the whole series. I got it for really cheap. I think I paid 30 bucks. I, I love the middle. It's, I mean, the early seasons are the best before um, before they start growing up. But that's all these shows, right? The kids yeah. start to grow up, and you're like, eh, this doesn't seem quite right. Nine seasons. You guys like the middle? Kind of incredible. Isn't it? Like, it's hard to believe there's nine seasons. Yeah. And I don't know how many episodes are on. Either way, we got it. The girlfriend loves it, too. It's like one of her favorite shows. Uh, we, we got Miss Marple. Uh, Agatha Christie, murder mystery movies. See what I'm saying, Ben? Like, it might have been someone, like, died and donated their... Yeah. That's a good cover, though. Yeah. Doesn't that make it look fun? Yeah. Guys, doesn't that look fun? I like murder mysteries. They're fun. It looks fun, and then there's a dead guy in the back. Yeah, there is a, de there is a dead guy. But it's like, <laughs> it's funny that it's like the old lady, like, investigating. She's like 70 years old. <laughs> Oh, this was a highlight too. We got Knight Rider, the complete series. You I, watch? Re I remember catching a couple episodes. Yep. Of that. So Kit with that fucking car with that light, the theme music, so good. Can only use Turbo Boost once per episode, though. That's true. Uh, I think I think that that's it right there. I also got Murder on the Oriental Express. Orient Express. Uh, another Agatha Christie. Caught the remake. That was. Oh, did you? Yeah, it wasn't bad. I don't even know there was a remake. Oh, man. So 18 minutes of a uh, haul right there. That was pretty good. Right? I think so. I mean... I mean... <laughs> right. There it is. There it is. Look, see, look, you see it over there? That is incredible. Looks pissed off. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Oh wow. I gotta do. I got. This is the IKEA shelf I was telling you about, guys. When I went to IKEA, this I built it in like. It took me twenty minutes. I'm that good. Or IKEA is just really simple. <laughs> Can it be both? Oh man. There we go. And there You're it is. For it. There it is. Right there. How'd I know to do that? Because I've seen other like channels like board game guys, they do that same thing. Oh, I get all my records down there. I got my I got we got a little of everything in here. Right? Yeah, it's pretty sexy. And Ben, what have you been playing? I uh, just finished up Persona 5 Strikers and uh, moving on to Neo The World Ends With You. See, Ben's way more exciting than me. I'm still just playing baseball. And you guys are like, <laughs> fuck baseball. No, fuck you. <laughs> what? I'm, I'm fucking 19 and 11 right now with the Red Sox. It's iffy. I'm in second place. The Yankees are in first, but I'm still doing pretty well. God, guys, give me a break here. 
Uh, yeah, there. Video games coming out. Anything you're looking forward to? Nothing I can think of off the top of my head. Pretty much just focusing on what I got right now. Yeah, there's not a whole lot. I can't think of anything either. Right. It's a rare moment. It is a. Well, <laughs> this past year has been bad. I'm like, I can't think of. Yeah, but I mean, there's usually something. Advance Wars is coming out That's sometime true. this fall. That's what I'm, I'm probably most excited about is that Advance Wars remake. Yeah. Outside of that. Uh, I mean, I got Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate is coming in the mail. That one on the, on the website, anyway, was 25. Okay. That was that's, decent. That's considering like the whole thing? Yeah. That's still going for like 50 in store. Now, did you buy the first edition? No. Oh. I waited for this one. All right. See, I like that, Ben. Normally, you would have been a day one purchase of that and then be like, motherfuckers. No. They got me again. No. No, um, no day one. No Molina. Yeah. No more fighting day one. Because <laughs> they, they just put out the game of the year edition every time. <laughs> yeah. They ain't getting us no more. No. No more 50 copies of Street Fighter Five. I did just order uh, seven games off of GameStop.com. So we'll see how many come complete. They have the buy five uh, under twenty dollars, get fifty percent off. Okay, that's decent. It was decent, but once again, we'll see if they show up complete. I, I, mean, I feel like you have a decent chance. They're not taking a whole lot in right now. I've, I've, I'm, the last order I put in, I got two out of the three complete. But the problem was the one that wasn't complete on the receipt was the one that was the free, the zero. So you can't uh, even return yeah. it without returning all of them? Yeah. I hate when we do that. Either way, we're fine. Uh, I think we're gonna we're gonna sign off now because, well, we got some stuff to clean up. I gotta do some cleaning and we're gonna catch up with Ben some more, but not on camera. So until next week, guys, um, you do what you do and um, toodaloo and um, fuck you, Ryan Parker. y'all. What the fuck? My dudes, how we doing? How we doing? Yo, what's up, bro? How you doing, brother? Oh, man, you're looking good. I know. I've been fucking, ever since we hit that shore, I've been hitting the gym, been working out, got my tan on, I just got out the bed. I'm feeling good. The tanning bed? Really? You guys are serious right now. You're going to leave me hanging all fucking day, just sitting here by myself? I'm about to make some Salisbury steaks. I got enough for all of us, so get your asses over here. Time's a wasting. These 40s are starting to hit me, so I got maybe three hours left at best. That's being, that's being generous.